crazy. Who knows? Maybe by the time I go run, some of the snow will be melted off. But mm, continental rubber. Papa's just getting the laundry going. What do you think of that? Papa's got a lot of laundry. Whoa, this is all Papa's running gear. Can you believe it? Yeah. Lots of running gear. Just, oh, what's that red thing right there? Which, the, the red thing? Yeah. That's, I think, just a sock. Yes. From the New York City, New York City Marathon. <laughs> It is so hot. Why? Because it just came out of the dryer. And guess what? It snowed a little bit last night. Isn't that cool? Uh, we can always use more snow, can't we, Henry? Always use more snow. Everything's hot. Everything's hot. Water first. Yeah, yeah you wash it first. And then you, and then you dry it. And then, and then you fold it. The fun part. We got laundry. Oh man, that's the only thing about winter running is the, the laundry goes way, way, way up. So we gotta fold that, but I'm trying to decide between what shoes to wear today. Let me just open these up with you. And I have a phone call in about 10 minutes. Critical phone call, exciting phone call for DGR, but first, um, okay. The shoes that I'm, I was gonna wear last night, all right, let's just open these up, a little one, two, and three, some Adidas. What are these, the Audi Stars, I do believe? Is that, the, yeah, the Audi Star. Gotta say, don't know a ton about the shoe. Uh, neutral for sure. Let's pull out the paper here, look at that. Nice little colorway there. You know what, it's immediately coming out of the box. What is it reminding me of? Um, oh, not the Pegasus. The Vimero, a little bit, just like a little bit, just the overall structure. Look at that heel and that heel area in the back. Oh my goodness. Wow, a little bit of a decoupled groove there on the outsole. Gotta say, into, okay, can't resist. Let's put it on the scale. Just see my gut reaction. If I can find a scale, there it is. Okay, hold on, let me just fire it up for all of you. So, the Audi Star, who is intrigued by the shoe? Let me know down in the comments, okay? We got it in grams first. Let's see what it is in grams. 293, pretty high, I do believe, coming in at 10.3 ounces for a daily trainer in my size. So, a little on the heavy side, but um, I was gonna take this shoe out. Should I, I guess that you're not watching this live, but should I, I, I might pivot to the Lone Peak Sixes for a little better traction out there in the fresh snowstorm today. Uh, we didn't get too much, maybe three inches outside, so it's not crazy, who knows? Maybe by the time I go run, some of the snow will be melted off. But mm, continental rubber versus ultra's grip there. What am I gonna do? All right, phone call time, then we'll lace it up. Actually, first we'll do laundry, then we'll lace it up, okay. Yeah, yeah, it's going, it's going really well. Um, yeah, lots, lots of good, uh, good things happening already, but excited uh, to talk with all of you. I actually have worked in the past with Lululemon. I've worked with Gymshark. I've worked with Nike, where they send me their, their running gear, and I test it out and re review it on my YouTube channel. So I have a lot of running gear that I've tested over the past three years. Um, so I could easily send, you know, you or whomever 
you know, the, sh the running shorts and the running kit that I like. Okay, great. Thank you. I will follow up soon. Uh, all right. Yep. Bye. I don't know about you. I get a little antsy. <laughs> I was going to run later, but you, know, you just get a little antsy. You want to get out there in the snow, get it done. That's what we're going to do. I will fold this today. I promise. I pr I'll do the, the good old clap to get it done. If you know what I mean, I'm doing it. Oh yeah. I'll talk to you a little bit later. A little bit. I got to go. I even just want to go mull over the phone call while running. Uh, it, oh, Lots of good things happening. But today, we're going to take out the Lone Peak 6. I decided over the Audi Star. I'm intrigued by this shoe, even though it's a little heavy. But we're going to go Lone Peak 6 just to make sure no slipping and sliding out there. And try as best as possible. That's the beauty of a fart lick. So today's call in the training was for a fart lick. So um, I'm going to do half of the, uh, I'm going to do the fart lick in the second half of the workout. All right? Of the run. All right, let's lace up. Here we go. It's plowed! It's plowed! Yeah! Woohoo! Real easy to slouch down when you're running in the snow. Up tall, up tall. Lift up, put those hips under your torso and lift your, your tailbone. And you just naturally lift your uh, hip flexor and quad more for a little better knee drive. All right, so lift and I can feel it so, so much. It puts me up on my forefoot, on my toes a little more and I instant, instantly speed up Woo! there it is there it is miles a week micronutrients it's I like, it's weird it's like as soon as I as soon as I cross over 90 to 100 miles a week it's like this is all I want after a run so that's what we're doing get those greens going you want some greens too yeah you want some greens go for it there you go spinach that's for you Popeye called. He wants his spinach back. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. I'm sorry, hon. I'm sorry. She's surviving, everybody. It's not... It's Sanka, you dead yet? <laughs> oh, she's, she, she's hanging tough. But this is hard. This is a hard one. So it's been, it's been a challenge. Hi, buddy. You making a mess? Why are you spilling your apples? <laughs> I tell you why, he's not banging his head. Yeah, this is Papa's. You don't want that. Mm -hmm. You want to bite a tuna? No. <laughs> Just give me like five minutes to. 
We're going to make it the pivot run today. First pivot of in a while where I've had to pivot because of the weather. So they said three inches of snow out on the ground. It felt more like five to six inches. So I had to pivot. It was just too, too much snow to go fast. So ended up doing, I just mentally told myself, like I said, out on the run, uh, focus on suppleness. So that strength, that uh, explosion through the lower ankle, which is actually a little benefit of doing a zero drop shoe in the Lone Peak 6 today, but also just fighting through the snow for 20 miles. Oh yeah, there's the run on your screen. Okay, nothing fast, but man, it felt, even though it was 20 miles, it felt more like 22 to 23, maybe even 24 miles in the legs. Just like fighting the snow, fighting the snow. Kevin Richards, you get the comment of the day. Here we go. Seth, thank you so much for giving us the secret sauce to training. You're welcome, Kevin. As a guy with no coach or trainer what is uh, that is injury prone, this is a game changer. Woo woo. That's right, Kevin. Woo woo. Right back to you. And that was yesterday's vlog talking about the 15 different run types. All right. Hopefully you gleaned a little, a little goodness out of that vlog. Um, so the phone call today, um, I guess it was more of a Zoom call. Very exciting. Uh, things are moving here for DGR. Okay. What was, um, actually, okay, here we go. Question of the day, because I, just question of the day, I just gotta go here. What was your number one goal for 2022 for your running? Do you remember what mine was? All right, if you remember, mark it down below in the comments. Sound good? And yes, now it's time. I refuse to let this day go by without getting this done, but hop over to my Instagram stories to see if I get it done today, okay? That's the challenge. Hop over to my Instagram stories. There's the handle. I'll take, if I, if I don't get uh, sidetracked here, I'm gonna get it done for the mission for, it's just those little things, those little things in life that uh, help us build a little virtue, a little bit of, a little bit of grit to, to do things that we don't wanna do. All right, everyone, we'll toss it to, um, hmm, hmm, gosh, you know, I don't know. I'll just go way back, you know, just kind of a, a throwback. I know a lot of people enjoy the throwback when the kids are really small, family vlogs, something something right there, right there, right there, all right? Back in the archive. Oh man, all right, seek beauty, work hard, and love each other. See you tomorrow.